we've seen lots of reports from campus this week, but none like the one we're about to air. This next story comes from a Mason journalism student who's not only reporting on the excitement, he's living it as well. Here's Haas Tabrizi with a student's eye view. Haas Tabrizi here in Fairfax, Virginia on the campus of George Mason University, home of the Final Four George Mason Patriots. The fans are going crazy, the students are skipping class, they're watching the games again in the Johnson Center, and they're standing out in line outside in the bookstore trying to get shirts for the Final Four. Coming up now on the Haas Show. Hey everybody, welcome to the Haas Show, I'm Haas. Now on to Know Your Players, I'm joined by Men's Volleyball. Now on to Papa John's Rapid Fire. Game number one, Minnesota at Carolina. All right, now moving on to NBA basketball, we're going to go ahead and start off with our teams of the week. My team of the week, the Bulls. Yeah, Chicago Bulls went 4-0 this week. They've won five straight games. More valuable Canadian to their team, Sean Powell or Natalia Perosa? Ooh, good question. Mark Kellen becomes NCAA champion if he doesn't get hurt. Check out this Final Four t-shirt sold here at the George Mason University bookstore for $18.98. Week to not team of the week, I'm going to go ahead and talk about the Los Angeles Lakers. They've lost seven straight games, okay? Seven straight games. This weekend, BCS got a little unscrambled. I made a nice little trip to Virginia Tech, watched number three host number five, and it wasn't the much anticipated battle. What brings more excitement to you, a big dunk or a big block? Probably a big dunk, you know, anytime you can dunk on somebody, it's two points, a block, you know, you might throw that out of bounds, they still get the ball, but two points, get the crowd into it, probably a big dunk. Speaking of points, who's a better shooter, Tony Skin or Lamar Butler? Man, that's, that's a tough one, put me on the spot, but I'd, I'd have to go with Lamar just because record-wise, I think he's up there in the in the history of the school with three point percentage. We've got Haas's complete student eye view report on our website, NBC4.com. Click on sports and check it out. All right, that was rapid fire. Thanks for tuning in to the Haas Show. Thanks for tuning in to the Haas Show.